Supplies and All-America cornerback Marcus Williams. I'm Scott Miller. And Marcus, tell me about this summer. I don't think people understand as football players, you really don't have much downtime. Yeah. So did you take a little bit of a break before you got back to the grind or not? Oh, uh, yeah, I took uh, about a two weeks of uh, break. Uh, but then after that, we came back up here and went right back at it. Coach, our strength and conditioning coach got us back up to it. Running, running after running and lifting in the morning. You're a team leader, Marcus. How tough is it for this team to stay focused and to try to do what you did last year? It seems to me that's a tough task. Oh, we just got to stay hungry. I mean, so we know now, uh, since we won it, the whole thing, we got a target on our back. So we just stay hungry and come and practice every day, working hard. I mean, we just hopefully have a good season like we did last year. What does a guy like you, an All-American quarterback, do in the summer to try to get better? Uh, just keep, I mean, just keep studying the game. Just keep going through film, you know, knowing what you got to do, and keep asking questions to the coaches. Cause, I mean, you try to get better every day. You can only get better. So, I mean, I just try to, I, I don't pay attention to all the accolades, but I just got to keep going out there and making plays and, and just go out there so I can know what to do when I go against my home. I know when I'm talking with the Bison coaches, now your defensive coordinator, Chris Kleiman, the thing that they always say is that Marcus is very talented, but he really is always working at it behind the scenes, studying tape. How important is that to your game? Uh, it's very important. I mean, I mean, studying film and, and going out there working hard and practicing is, is what makes me who I am. I mean, I try to go out there and prepare as much as I can because, I mean, if you think that you, I mean, just because you want an All-American award and you just think you can't work as hard the next year, I mean, that's when things can just go south from there. So I try to stay hard and stay humble and work on what I have to do. Hey, it seems to me the secondary is folded here. You know, you've got you on one quarter. You've got Brendan Pierre on another quarter. We've got Andre Martin, who has transferred in from Northern Iowa. And then at safety is Colton Hegel and now Christian Dudson. Just what do you guys think about it when you all get together as a position group and look at all of the talent you have back there? Uh, we know we got a... Uh, you know, we're deep in the secondary, so we got a lot of people fighting for spots. So we I mean, just got to come out here, I mean, we're working every day at fall camp, uh, working hard, sweating, getting ready for the season. So we're going to come out here and see who earns your spot and see who's ready to play. And how much does that help each of you, Marcus, to, to push one another knowing you have all that talent in the secondary? Keeps you, it keeps you on the edge. It makes you not get complacent because you know if you mess up, the next person is going to go in there and take your spot. So you try to go out there and do as well as you can so you can stay hungry and stay, and stay on the field. The defensive line is another strength for the Bison. And I'm just curious, when you're at the back end of the defense, how nice is it knowing that you've got guys like Cole Jurek and Kyle Emanuel and all of them rushing the quarterback? I mean, I mean, when you know you're going to have a probably a three-second, four-second play. It only makes it much better for you. But you know, you don't have to play the defense or cover every receiver that long. So we have a great D-line, great defensive end. So I'm looking forward to the season a lot. In September, Robert Morris to start, and then at Colorado State, you've got Prairie View A&M, and then at Northern Iowa. So it's always difficult in the Missouri Valley Football Conference. What are your thoughts about those first four games in September? Well, the first four games are going to be tough. We schedule tough teams every year. The first game, Robert Morris. We're going to go out there and play, play the game like we're going to do, studying just like we always do every team. So I mean, we know it's going to be a, a big month for us in September, so we're going to come out here and prepare well for it. you have video tape of that Gopher game that you scored a couple of touchdowns? Well, my parents t it. I mean, I watched it probably once after that. But, I mean, I try not to look too much into so it probably when I'm done playing. We have to a few years from now, I'll probably look back at it. But for now, just still trying to go out there and work and focus on the 24 defense. Right? As outstanding as the defense was a year ago, can this defense be even better, Marcus? Yeah, yeah, I think it could be even better. I mean, we're trying to come out here and, and, and work as hard every day. I mean, we're out here hustling to the ball, running to the ball, just trying to stay in shape, and just watching film. I mean, we watch film all the time. So, I mean, you can only get better from it. Thanks for the visit. Best of luck for another great year. Thank you. Bison, a junior quarterback, Marcus Williams.